G'day Cobbers, welcome back to the bush. In this video we'll be cooking up a storm. In fact, we'll be cooking red wine beef stew. But first up, let's grab our beef. Nice diced beef. We'll pop it into a mixture of flour, pepper and salt. Then we'll give it a good shake. We need to make sure we coat all the surfaces nice and evenly. And then we'll brown it off. So when we brown it off, the nicely coated beef We'll cook the flour, and then we might get the flour taste going through our stew. So we'll get back to you when it's all nice and brown. Okay, so now we've browned off the meat. Just a little bit. That'll cook through on the coals. We'll transfer it across to our pot. Make sure we dump it all in. the vegetables and we've pre-prepared a few vegetables here a few carrots and onions potatoes celery don't forget the mushrooms and then a few baby peas and corn Pop that in, and then we grab our beef stock. Full litre, right over the top. That's complete, give it a bit of a mix up. And now let's head over to the fire. But before we head over to the fire, a little bit of red wine to your pan. Mix in all the little bits and pieces in the bottom to deglaze the pan, and we'll add that to the mix in a second. We'll see you at the fire. Right, so we've brought the uh, beef and red wine. Okay, so we've brought the beef and red wine stew over to the fire. We've moved some coals away so we can keep control of the temperature. Put it on top, and we'll jump into the fire. Grab a half a shovel of coals, pop it on top, and we'll check on it in 15 minutes. All right, it's been about 20 minutes or so, so let's check on it. Firstly, move the coals away from the edge. We don't want any extra crunchy bits in our dinner. Lift the top up, give it a bit of a stir. Starting to look really nice, starting to come along nicely the vegetables still aren't cooked through so we'll put the top back on make sure it's seated properly now we'll get an extra shovel of uh, embers and put them on top okay it's been on the ball now for about an hour or so so let's check it out smells absolutely fantastic and it's done but as they say proof is in the pudding We've got a few hungry four-wheel drivers here, so come on over, James, and give it a go. There you go, mm -hmm. mate. Cheers, mate. Mm. Oh, that's beautiful, mate. Thanks. Good job. So, a job well done. Now, so if you like this video, don't forget to rate, comment and subscribe. Give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Now, if you didn't enjoy it, of course, give us a thumbs down. Twice. Thanks, guys. We'll see you in the next one. I think we need a few more coals, gents. Before we head over, we'll grab some red wine, 
throw a bit in the pan, we'll deglaze the pan, and we get all those remnants in the bottom. Mix it all up, and we'll add that in with the pot. Is that enough in there? <laughs> uh, all this fancy cooking, I'm not used to mushrooms and shit. <laughs> <laughs>